Empower your life as a 21st century superhuman with host Carrie Kiristar Ellis and guests. Navigate these times of great change with Carrie's 21st Century Superhuman book series, being called the most important books on the planet and guidebooks for our times. You are a creator. Remember to breathe, smile, and love. For as we change ourselves, we change the world. Learn more at 21stCenturySuperhuman.com. Hi there. Good morning, everyone. I'm Carrie Ellis, author of 21st Century Superhuman, and this is one of our 21st Century Superhuman Lives. I just want to remind you today, we are in the time of the WESAC, the WESAC full moon, which the WESAC is a really special event in the Buddhist lands. Um, It commemorates Buddha's birth death, and his enlightenment. We're also in probably the most powerful super moon of the year. Um, it's called the flower moon. It's a spring moon. And so we're in the window. The actual WESAC was yesterday. The full moon, I, I call it, there's always a three-day doorway around these windows. And so we have the power of this energy um, during this window of time. So we're in a time where actually instant enlightenment can happen. And what's so exciting about this is we're also in the time of the shift of the ages. We are in the times of great change. And, you know, I've been noticing lately, all of this, all of the news is coming out and it's coming out like a dam that broke, you know, of all of the, everything going on around the world the control systems and the control systems kind of breaking right now and people waking up and saying we're not willing to be controlled and we're not willing to live under these control systems and what it's really important that we ask ourselves in this moment in this time and we have all this help from the universe from the cosmos from light pouring in from these powerful portal days what am I doing? What am I choosing? Where am I focusing my mind, my consciousness? Am I focusing on it on, oh, ain't that awful? Or isn't that a terrible thing that's happened to humanity? Or isn't that something terrible we're fighting? Or am I focusing on the joy in my being? Am I focusing on who I am as an amazing being? Am I focusing on my vision of a better world? Because every bit of our attention that we give to that negative disclosure news. We'll say the disclosure news is positive, but it's about our shadows. But every amount that we focus on those, we literally are holding them in form. So this is how conscious creation works. The, the, the intent of our mind, the intent of our heart, the intent of our spirit, our walk of mastery. And let's choose that this day, this we suck time, this powerful moon, full moon portal time. Let's choose to focus in our own positive creation. Let's focus on that which we love, that which brings joy, the world that we choose to see. And let's quit giving energy to the old stories, the old shadows, the old darkness, because every time we do, and and it's our fear, our lower level emotions that holds us kind of magnetically to those things, because we're going to connect with that which we're in frequency with. And life is all about frequency. We are creating frequency. We are living in frequency. We are a moving frequency being. So as we choose to live in a higher frequency, higher frequency will vibrate around us. If we are choosing higher frequency, what we do with our body, our mind, and our spirit is what will literally appear around us. This is so important. It is our biggest walk of mastery that there ever has been on planet Earth because we have the consciousness to understand it in this great shift of the ages. So much love to you all. I just want to say have an awesome day. Have an awesome WESAC. Have an awesome full moon portal. And be the most powerful being that you can be. Envision that which is filled with joy, which is filled with love, which is filled with goodness for all. And let's let these shadows dissipate. Let's 
fill the world with so much light that those shadows can't exist anymore. This is how we change the world. Um, I just want to share one really quick thing. We've gotten rain in the last couple of days after like a four month drought. It's been super dry where I am. I mean, the leaves are like powder. There's been fires everywhere. This is in the Yucatan. And um, on Sunday, we had a gathering without masks of really beautiful people, just very loving, loving, awake people. And we made organite, Ormus, and plasma products, which included GANs and nano-coated health pens. So plasma tools, I should say. And all of these powerful, powerful um, science of the future tools, and they've been here for a while, but Organite, again, which helps dispel the dark energies and restore the natural currents of the earth. And Ormus, which brings in these nano levels of mineral radiance that are bringing everything into balance. And then the plasma tools, which actually activate and focus plasma in our world. Plasma is the life force that we're surrounded by. So we made a whole bunch of these things on Sunday in a really beautiful, loving environment. And within four days, it began to rain and we're now in a rainy cycle. So how cool is that? I, we can call it coincidence, but we can just say, or these are the facts. This is, this is what we did. This is what happened. Whether they're connected, I don't know. But everything you do matters. Everything you say matters and everything you think matters. So I'm going to remind you today, breathe, smile, and love, and we'll see you soon. Um, I am interviewing Sacha Stone tomorrow, Saturday, and I was going to do it live, but I think I'm not because the level of bandwidth that I have just doesn't support a really strong recording when I do that, especially if I have another person on. So I'll record it early in the morning like this, and I'll have it up within a couple of hours as quick as I can. And I'll be re interviewing Peter Moon this afternoon. He's an amazing author about time travel, about the Sphinx and the pyramid and all these underground tunnels in Romania, um, just a bunch of really amazing things around the world. So, and he's a pretty powerful um, intelligent person. So always really nice to talk to him. So I'll have that out later this afternoon. So watch our, for our videos, check out my website, 21stCenturySuperhuman.com. Um, the audiobook and the ebook are just about to you. Um, we're doing some additional technical things behind the scenes. Breathe, smile, and love, and be the powerful being that you are, and we shall see you soon. Okay, ciao. Much love, many blessings. First century superhuman and I know that the answers are inside Yeah, I am the 21st century superhuman Now, now, now is the time Come, come, come on everyone Let's celebrate We are the children of the sun I can see you when I look into your eyes. We are the same, and we are light, and yeah, we are one. Hear now, hear my ancient prayer and sing along. We are awakening as one. And we can make a difference, yeah, we can be the change it takes to make the world a lot more fun.